FOX01, Wikipedia Audio 3C06, 3C07, 3COA, 4LG0 NM002015 NM019739 Function NP002006 NP062713 Androgen receptor, estrogen receptor alpha, Krebs binding protein, and tuberous sclerosis protein 2. Forkhead box protein O1 also known as forkhead in rhabdomyosarcoma is a protein that in humans is encoded by the FOX01 gene. FOX01 is a transcription factor that plays important roles in regulation of gluconeogenesis and glycogenolysis by insulin signaling, and is also central to the decision for a pre-adipocyte to commit to adipogenesis. It is primarily regulated through phosphorylation on multiple residues, its transcriptional activity is dependent on its phosphorylation state. FOX01 negatively regulates adipogenesis. Presently, the exact mechanism by which this is accomplished is not entirely understood. In the currently accepted model, FOX01 negatively regulates adipogenesis by binding to the promoter sites of PARG and preventing its transcription. Rising levels of PARG are required to initiate adipogenesis. By preventing its transcription, FOX01 is preventing the onset of adipogenesis. During stimulation by insulin, FOX01 is excluded from the nucleus and is subsequently unable to prevent transcription of PARG and inhibit adipogenesis. However, there is substantial evidence to suggest that there are other factors that mediate the interaction between FOX01 and the PARG promoter and that inhibition of adipogenesis is not entirely dependent on FOX01 preventing transcription of PARG. The failure to commit to adipogenesis is primarily due to active FOX01 arresting the cell in G0-G1 through activation of yet unknown downstream targets, with the putative target being SOD2. FOX01 belongs to the forkhead family of transcription factors that are characterized by a distinct forkhead domain. The specific function of this gene has not yet been determined, however, it may play a role in myogenic growth and differentiation. FOX01 is essential for the maintenance of human ESC pluripotency. This function is probably mediated through direct control by FOX01 of OCT4 and SOX2 gene expression through occupation and activation of their respective promoters. In hepatic cells this transcription factor seems to increase the expression of PEPC and glycogen 6-phosphatase. Blocking this transcription factor offers an opportunity for novel therapies for diabetes mellitus. In pancreatic alpha cells FOX01 is important in regulating pre-proglucagon expression. In pancreatic beta cells FOX01 mediates glucagon-like peptide 1 effects on pancreatic beta cell mass. When the level of blood glucose is high, the pancreas releases insulin into the bloodstream. Insulin then causes the activation of PI3K which subsequently phosphorylates anite. Anite then phosphorylates FOX01, causing nuclear exclusion. This phosphorylated FOX01 is then ubiquitinated and degraded by the proteosome. The phosphorylation of FOX01 is irreversible, this prolongs insulin's inhibitory effect on glucose metabolism and hepatic glucose production. Transcription of glucose 6-phosphatase subsequently decreases, which consequently decreases the rates of gluconeogenesis and glycogenolysis. FOX01 also activates transcription of phosphenolpyruvate carboxykinase, which is required for gluconeogenesis. 
The activity of FOXO1 is also regulated through CBP induced acetylation on LIS-242, LIS-245 and LIS-262. These lysine residues are located within the DNA binding domain. Acetylation inhibits the ability of FOXO1 to interact with the glucose 6-phosphatase promoter by decreasing the stability of the FOXO1 DNA complex. Additionally, this acetylation increases the rate of phosphorylation on SIR-253 by anite. Interestingly, mutating SIR-253 to ALA-253 makes FOXO1 constitutionally active. SIRT1 reverses this acetylation process, however, the exact mechanism by which SIRT1 deacetylates FOXO1 is still under investigation. Presently, acetylation is thought to mitigate the transcriptional activity of FOXO1 and thereby provide an additional level of metabolic regulation that is independent of the insulin slash PI 3K pathway. FOXO1 may play an important role in apoptosis because it is phosphorylated and inhibited by AKT. When FOXO1 overexpressed in human lung gap prostate cancer cells, it caused apoptosis in these cancer cells. Also, it is detected that FOXO1 regulated tunferlated apoptosis inducing ligand which cause FOXO1-induced apoptosis in the human prostate cancer cell line LAPC4 when FOXO1 adenovirus-mediated overexpression was used. FOXO1 upregulate FOS ligand transcriptionally that result in promotes apoptotic cell death. Additionally, FOXO1 transactivate BIM protein which a member of the BCL2 family that promotes apoptosis and plays a role in the intrinsic mitochondrial apoptotic pathway. Further, it was revealed that DNA damage induced cell death in P53 deficient and P53 proficient cells reduced when human FOXO1 silenced by CERNA. FOXO1 activation plays a role in cell cycle progression regulation. The transcription and half-life of cyclin-dependent kinase inhibitor P27KIP1 rises when FOXO1 is active. A study detects that FOXO1 regulates the nuclear localization of P27KIP1 in porcine granulosa cells and impacts cell cycle progression. Furthermore, FOXO1-mediated cell cycle arrest is linked with cyclin D1 and cyclin D2 suppression in mammals. It was detected that human FOXO1 is linked with the cyclin D1 promoter using chromatin immunoprecipitation assays. H215R is a human FOXO1 mutant, which cannot bind to the canonical FRE to induce expression of P27KIP1 repress cyclin D1 and cyclin D2 promoter activity and encourages cell cycle arrest at cyclin G1. As a result of that, activation of FOXO1 prevents the cell division cycle at cyclin G1 out of one of two ways stimulating or suppressing gene transcription. In its unphosphorylated state, FOXO1 is localized to the nucleus where it binds to the insulin response sequence located in the promoter for glucose 6-phosphatase and increases its rate of transcription. FOXO1, through increasing transcription of glucose 6-phosphatase, indirectly increases the rate of hepatic glucose production. However, when FOXO1 is phosphorylated by anite on THR24, SIR256 and SIR319, it is excluded from the nucleus, where it is then ubiquitinated and degraded. The phosphorylation of FOXO1 by anite subsequently decreases the hepatic glucose production through a decrease in transcription of glucose 6-phosphatase. Adipogenesis there are three processes, namely acetylation, phosphorylation, and ubiquitination that are responsible for regulation of the activity of 4 boxo one 
Phosphorylation of the FOXO1 protein is a result of the activation of the PI3K slash AKT pathway. Serum and glucocorticoid inducible kinase SGK can also phosphorylate and inactivate FOXO1 transcription factor. FOXO1 translocate from the nucleus to cytoplasm and inactivate through phosphorylation at well-defined sites by AKT slash SGK1 protein kinases. FOXO1 transcription factor can phosphorylate directly by AKT slash SGK1 on three sites T24, S256 and S319. Additionally, FOXO1 loses its interactions with DNA when phosphorylated by AKT slash SGK1 because S256, which is one of the three AKT slash SGK sites, changes the DNA binding domain charge from a positive charge to a negative charge. Insulin signaling substrates 1 and 2 of the insulin signaling cascade also regulate FOXO1 through phosphorylation by AKT. AKT, which is referred to as protein kinase B, phosphorylates FOXO1 and accumulates in the cytosol. Casein kinase 1, a growth factor activated protein kinase also phosphorylates and potentiates FOXO1 and translocates FOXO1 to the cytoplasm. Because FOXO1 provides a link between transcription and metabolic control by insulin, it is also a potential target for genetic control of type 2 diabetes. In the insulin resistant murine model, there is increased hepatic glucose production due to a loss in insulin sensitivity, the rates of hepatic gluconeogenesis and glycogenolysis are increased when compared to normal mice, this is presumably due to unregulated FOXO1. When the same experiment was repeated with haploinsufficient FOXO1, insulin sensitivity was partially restored and hepatic glucose production subsequently decreased. Similarly, in mice fed with a high-fat diet, there is increased insulin resistance in skeletal and liver cells. However, when haploinsufficient FOXO1 mice were treated with the same HFD, there was a notable decrease in insulin resistance in both skeletal and liver cells. This effect was significantly augmented by the simultaneous administration of rosiglitazone, which is a commonly prescribed anti-diabetic drug. These results create an opportunity for a novel gene therapy-based approach to alleviating insulin desensitization in type 2 diabetes. In HFD-fed mice, the combination of FOXO1 and NOTCH1 haploinsufficiency was more effective at restoring insulin sensitivity than FOXO1 haploinsufficiency alone. Insulin-producing cells could be generated through the inhibition of FOXO1 in intestinal organoids generated from intestinal stem cells isolated from adult tissue. Gluconeogenesis and Glycogenolysis Apoptosis. FOXO1 has been shown to interact with Cell cycle regulation Mechanism of action Regulation Phosphorylation Research This article incorporates text from the United States National Library of Medicine, which is in the public domain. Clinical Significance Interactions